dark, calm waters of Scapa Flow on the 21st of June 1919, the interned Grand Fleet of the Imperial German Navy destroyed itself in one last act of defiance against her captains. Yet only 20 years later, the naval power of the Third Reich would challenge Britain's long-established supremacy of the oceans. On the eve of World War II, the young Kriegsmarine prepared to join battle with the unforgotten adversary, the Royal Navy. For over a decade, the German Navy had been rebuilding in secret. With the coming to power of Adolf Hitler, all subterfuge was cast aside. A new grand fleet of revolutionary warships emerged from the slipways of German dockyards. Their names would become bywords throughout the world. The new Kriegsmarine could present initially an impressive seeming order of battle. Its officers were of high quality. Many had served in the old Imperial Navy and were heirs to a tradition of independence which frowned upon the excesses of Nazi fanaticism. 